Yeah, hello and welcome back to Scavenging the Atlas. And today it's a patch day, which I'm very, very happy about. I was reading up on the patch notes and one of the biggest problems that I've had in the early game of Atlas has finally been addressed, and it's the loot tables. Uh, we'll find out if they're actually going to be uh, any good over time, but um, they've rejigged how many blueprints are in the loot. They also changed some real items to be in the loot, not just blueprints. And that sounds fantastic to me. Now they did nerf some things along the way. Uh, the handling speed acceleration got capped. Uh, so it got reduced. So um, I see a lot of people getting really annoyed by that. But um, yeah, they did that anyway. Um, hmm. We'll see whether it affects me or not. Probably not so much in the single player game. Some people are really dirty about it, but I'm not. The loot change is quite enough for me. There's a few bits and pieces around torpedoes and grenades and a bunch of other little bits and pieces. Uh, they did change how much damage creatures do to players. And they did change the range of attack of creatures against players as well. Um, but yeah, in a single player environment that's not really going to do much. Now, I've repaired my ship. Um, I'm on a power stone island over here. And since I've come back into the game with my tiny little shack over there, creatures have spawned and so I'm currently surrounded by tigers uh, it is not safe to get onto land now at all so yeah at any rate I want to go and kill some ships of the damned apparently the high tier ships of the damned galleons spawn uh, more I should say there's more of them actually spawn um, and yeah they drop better loot well they drop real loot I need to go and actually find a treasure, so get a good map, go and find a treasure and see what loot I can actually get. Uh, and while that's happening, quickly just scroll down on these patch notes because there's a huge list of changes to these loot tables. Oh yeah, that's just about it. Okay, and they changed the level cap. Apparently the level cap was 150. Uh, I've never actually made it to 150, but now the level cap's back to 100. And 20. Alright. Now I'm on a power stone island, so we should actually end up finding, hopefully, some high level ships of the dead. And I probably need to. Uh, that's north. Okay, so I need to head back. Uh, we could just go straight into C5. Let's do that. What have I got? Uh, I've put all my maps away. I'll have to find them. Oh, here we go. We're already on. The low level ones. What? Oh, that's not what I was expecting. I'm at Power Stone Island, it should be a little bit harder. Oh, here we go. There we go. Level 72. Wow. Killed Angry Charlotte. I must have shot someone in the water. Level 48 Galleon. Oh, this is going to take a bit. Probably going to get up a lot of hits here. Although front on from them is actually better. They don't have many guns on the front as they do the sides. Unlike now, 
once they get side on, they're going to open up on me. Come on, let's just have a volley side by side. Come on. This is a crazy way to do warfare with Galleon. My cannons do more damage. Bam. Take out this little guy. Nice. Alright, let's start collecting loot before I lose it all. Blueprint. Medium cannonball, blueprint, grape shot. So nothing yet that's not good. Common wood ceiling. Well, there's an item, but it's a terrible item. A fine swivel gun. Okay, there's an item. And a journeyman wood ceiling. Well, some items, but I wouldn't say that I got anything particularly good. Basically, it was a fine swivel gun somewhere in there. And it was the actual gun as opposed to a blueprint. Oh, there we go. A fine swivel gun. Got a couple of them. Alright. Um, any more loot? Oh, yeah, some more up there. Uh, a couple of blueprints, and I broke my grappling hook. Time to find treasure. I need to head north. Alright, we should be able to just get straight through these. damage is this thing? Oh, it's not too bad actually. It's fully repaired. No, 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 on. Oh, that was a uh, mermaid. It's trying to drag me off the ship. You can see the circle behind me there. Whew, it's the first time I've run into one. Close one. I'm probably, as you may have seen what I did there, um, I got my grappling hook, I grappled myself onto my boat, and then let my boat drive me out of range of the mermaid. Uh, once they start singing at you, you've got... There's nothing you can do, they just drag you into the water. Uh, I believe there is an achievement you can do for being dragged into the water and you go and say hello to them. But um, I'll worry about that achievement another time. So it's getting late, but I found a treasure. It's a C5, it's only a common treasure, but it will suffice. All we need to do is prove that once destroyed, it drops loot that is not blueprints.
That bear is going to walk right into the range, isn't it? Yeah, this bear's actually taking a beating. That's right. Got the guy on the back foot now. Oi, don't you be sinking. Right. Bear is annoyingly close. Have I got my shovel? Yes. Alright, come on loot. Give me items and not blueprints. Boom. 3.7 quality. Let's have a look. Blueprints. I actually got a common stone bow. A common carbine. A common cloth hat. Well, it's, it is common loot. There you go. Common fur gauntlets. Ah, some fine hide boots. Quippable. I can't obviously make them at the moment, because I haven't got the right materials or a tannery, but I actually got an item that is usable. Uh, when I look at my character, I'm currently wearing common hide boots, so that is a direct upgrade. And really, that's what I would have expected to be in the game already. Okay, fine plate boots. What else have we got in here? Some spears. Probably already had me. That's already my sword. Uh, yeah, that must have been from the ships where I got the journeyman wood ceiling. Oh, okay, and I actually got a couple of shields. So it was only common loot. Obviously, if I found something a little bit better, it probably would have given something a bit better. But it is a very good example of the current changes. Uh, and yeah. Really, what I'm going to be doing now is it, it puts a lot more onus on farming up this stuff. Um, you don't have to rely on collecting materials anymore. You can just get a whole bunch of treasure maps, go treasure hunting. Sure, you're going to get a, still get a lot of blueprints, but you will get gear. You'll get usable gear. You'll be able to upgrade your stuff without having to farm resources. And that, that's big. It's useful. Basically, I'm surprised they didn't have it in the game already. Right, oh, level up. Is that for me? Yeah, it was too. Nice. Worry about that later. All right. Well, that's basically it, really, from the the patch notes and what's actually been done. Um, yeah. So killed a few ships of the damned. Checked out the loot. Went treasure hunting. Checked out the loot. And yeah, I'm happy with the results of what I've actually done. Really now I'm going to have to go and find some higher level treasure maps and just go hunting. I mean these bears that I have are quite useful against the armies of the damned. And that's a terrible... Uh, well, yeah, it's not, not much better either. Alright, at any rate, thanks for watching Scarving in the Atlas. And yeah, I'm going to continue building my base over on the Power Island. And, um, yeah, hopefully the next thing that I'll be getting into is um, more mythos farming, more loot drop farming, and get myself set up so that I can actually take on the Hydra. And, yeah, I'll catch you next time.